Hello guys, welcome back to the Gigabyte Motherboards Bricks YouTube channel. My name is Brian and today we're going to take a look at the 3D OSD. The 3D OSD is an app on the App Center that gives gamers key information such as CPU speed, CPU temperature, system fan speed, and for those who are overclocking, base clock multiplier. So let's take a look at 3D OSD. So to open a 3D OSD, you can go to the Gigabyte App Center. On the far, upper far left corner is the 3D OSD icon. So just click on it to open it. And you can choose, on the OSD tab, you can choose um, what kind of information you want to display. For example, the FPS, CPU information, CPU usage, CPU fan, uh, PCH temperature, CPU temperature. So you can choose which information you want to display in-game. And for the display settings, um, you can toggle on and off with, uh, by pressing F2 as a default key. And the text size as well, you know, if you want, if you want to make it a little bigger just, or smaller, just, uh, just adjust the text size accordingly. And the text color, if you want a little bit darker, like you know, blue or purple, you can adjust it as well. And you can also adjust where you want it to be positioned on screen. So the upper left hand corner, as shown here. If you want it in the middle, you can just click in the middle. And also we have a really cool feature called the cooldown feature, which is a CD feature. Um, so what this does is basically, you know, it sets a timer so you can keep uh, count of, for example, like neutral objectives um, or, you know, when to group up with your team. So you can also set a hotkey for that, set it as F5 here, and a time timer for that, for example, one minute. So you can name it, you can return the base. So if you toggle the hotkey in game, it'll give, you, it'll give you a timer. And for apply to, you can choose uh, which apps you don't want it to affect. So if it's not on this list, you can just click the plus bottom, plus sign at the bottom, and you can just pick the exe file of which of the you know file that you don't want to be affected by 3D OSD. And for pro profile settings, you can save it and you know upload it. For example, if you go to um, like a PC cafe or a friend's house, and they have a gigabyte motherboard, you can apply those settings as well. So you can export and import. So let's run a benchmark. So right now we're going to try the Rise of the Tomb Raider game, which is a relatively uh, graphics intensive game. So once we start the game, we can open the display settings. So F2 to toggle the settings. So as you can see here, it showed up on the left hand side as we set it in the OSD interface. So um, let's run a benchmark. So you can see the information that we um, that we decided to show that we chose to show on the 3D OSD interface, and um, we can also trigger the F5 timer for return to base. So there's 57 seconds. It starts from one minute. Now there's 50, 53, 52 seconds. Return to base. So um, as you can see, um, this gives you vital information uh, when you're in game, so you know. You're whether your computer is performing at a peak levels and you know what to what to adjust if necessary. So yeah, that's how the 3D OSD interface uh, shows in game. So that was a look at our 3D OSD. If you want to leave a comment, please leave it on our YouTube channel. And if you want to know more, please visit our Facebook. Thank you.